Yo guys, what is going on? JPS back from another video. And today we're going to be reacting to James Blunt Monsters. It's been a while since we've done any song reactions on this channel and I really do miss them because I'm a huge fan of a lot of different genres of music. Been listening to a ton of Oasis lately for all you guys, so I think it's time we get back into some into some reactions, some music reactions. But we're going to be starting that off with James Blunt Monsters. This video has been circulating a lot among reaction channels, uh, and it's been recommended by a few people, so I figured why not give it a go, and that's exactly what we're going to be doing. So hit the like button, hit subscribe, and let's get right into this. I, don't, I have no idea what to expect. Here we go. I won't read you your wrongs or your rights The time has gone I'll tell you goodnight, close the door Tell you I love you once more The time has gone So here it is I'm not your son You're not So here it is I'm not your son You're not my father We're just two grown men saying goodbye Ooh. No need to forgive No need to forget I know your mistakes and you know mine And what? Chase the monsters away. 
it's a <laughs> it's a very powerful song really caught me off guard uh i think after the initial chorus when he said well it was part of the chorus but he said i'm not your son or you're not my father and i'm not your son either that or the reverse but it's very powerful uh my own interpretation of it his father was dying there was a broken father-son relationship yet the son was vowing to make the father proud and chase the monsters away chasing the monsters away could mean a lot of different things to me i guess that means being a man i guess and and like uh protecting others maybe family or whatever the case may be that that's my own interpretation of that who knows if there was an original meaning uh you guys can let me know in the comments um i'm sure there was but this is a very powerful and lyrical song i love the different the changes in his uh in his voice like you know some of the some of the lines he he sang were much higher than than others and seemed to be a very emotionally driven song uh interesting choice for the music video having the tears form and kind of get worse throughout but then as he's sitting with his dad you know there's no tears still a, a bit of a look of fear and despair but still still no tears so i guess he's solidifying his courage and taking over his father's role i i really don't know there's there's a lot of different you know there's a million ways you could decipher the meaning of a song and that's the beautiful thing about music is a song could mean so much to someone and to another person it's just another generic poppy song but that, that's what's so beautiful about it is certain songs will touch you in ways that you didn't know you could be touched in could have rephrased that <laughs> Anyways, it was a good one, though. So I really appreciate you guys for recommending that. If you have other music you want me to... Please, please, matter of fact, not even if you have. Throw some songs in the comments. Throw some albums. We're going to bring back the music reactions on this channel because I really, really love doing reactions to music and, and, and finding some new music. So hit the like button, guys, if you enjoyed that. Hit the subscribe button. Consider joining the Patreon. First link in the description for full reactions to British shows and movies. Another thing I forgot to mention is that James Blunt is English. Probably should have said that at the start. But anyways, guys, I'm going to catch you all in the next one.